in Japan, there are lots of huge enterprises. And all these enterprises have their own workflow and style. So basically, they are all different companies and they have all different IT adoption, each of them. So I think the uniqueness of Japan is you have to customize every AI application tailored to the enterprise use cases to make them smooth running into their own workflow. So I think that's one of the challenges we have. And also the other one is about the language. It's because like in the Japanese language have lots of vague, I mean, expressions. So it's pretty hard for you to directly translate it from a language like English or Chinese. So in, in some way, we have to gather more material in Japanese to make a more like natural Japanese language generation. So I think that both of, both of the two parts are kind of a challenge for us right now. The first one is I think like Quinn is definitely leading the open source community right now. And uh, there are of course lots of other companies doing this, but now Quinn is updating their model really fast. And also they show uh, great interest in languages other than English and Chinese. I think that's a point. It's because like most of the other open source models, they basically focus on English or Chinese. But for Quain, they focus on Japanese, they focus on Arabians. They have lots of different choices and they're eager to promote this into what we call minor language families. So I think that's one of the reasons we choose Quain. And also it's because the community size, like we have lots of people using Quain already in Japan right now. So it's pretty easy for us to pick up some use cases or like share our ideas or experiences on using Quain. Japan definitely have lots of leading industries from the history, and they have lots of this uh, experience based on manual work or like uh, basically written down into manual transcripts. And that's kind of hard for you to search, or it's really hard for younger generations to memorize, to like use those kinds of knowledge. But I think AI is really useful in that case because we have all this like tens of years of decades of, uh, I mean, written material and even some records on industry promotion. And then if you input those into AI, it will be e much easier for the younger generations to catch up those strengths and capabilities. And it will be utilized better for like other industries in Japan or like even for their future own use cases.